It's time to get your team members to work together. It's a task management system that's called Upbase, and they have a really attractive free forever plan as of this video, so you won't want to miss out. Let me show you what I'm talking about. This is Upbase, and this is their main site. If you guys wanna check it out, there's a link in the description. Let me show you the free attractive plan that they have as of now. So it's a free early access, and it's free forever, and this is what you're going to get. So you get unlimited tasks and unlimited users. That's really attractive. And if you need the paid plan, it's also pretty affordable. Now, let's get into a base. This is my up base dashboard, and we're gonna be able to work with our team members together. One of the things I like about up base, it's that it's easy to use. Sometimes complex task management systems make it really hard because it's complex, they have files everywhere, they have chat systems apart, and this is all this all comes together. So I'll show you the quick through menu of this to get started. First of all, we have our schedules. This is where we're going to view all our schedules. We can view all of them by the list that we have created by dates. We can scroll through these. We can view all tasks. We can view tasks from other people. We can schedule tasks if we need to add one really quickly. We can mark it's completed and we can move these along if we like. We also have the my task, which is where I'm going to see the task that are assigned to me or my team members are gonna view their own tasks, which I'll show you in a bit. There's also a chat system created inside of here so I can chat with other team members. So for example, I've created this user that's called Max Steel and I can chat with them in the general list that we have created, the task management, or I can message him directly. So there's two ways to message with people by the list that we've created or directly to him. So I can say, okay, so I can respond to him and he's gonna be able to view it on his end. So let's go into his chat the chat that we have, and I, I see the response that he responded to me, and I can say okay to him back, all right? So it's super easy to do that way, all right? There's also the list. This is where the fun part starts. This is where we can create a brand new list. Let me go ahead and create one for you. We can create folder or list. In this case, we'll create a list. We could add the color to it so we can identify it later on. An icon for this, so we can put this if they're more important or however you want to design or get around with your team members so they know which one of these icons is intended for. We can name this, for example, um, this video, all right? I can add a description to this and I can select list or board. We can change this later if we like. So I'll go ahead and create list. And I created this section, which just added to my list section on the left. Now in this case, I can assign members. So in this case, I want to assign a member that I have and I want to give them full access can comment soon and can view soon. This is coming soon, but in this case, we'll give them full access as of now. So now they're invited into this workspace that's called the list, and it's this video. We can create tasks in this way. So in this section, we created a list, but we can change it into board if we like. So we have same um, content, but different type of view, whatever works best for you. So in this case, we can name something like, for example, working on, you can change this to, for example, done, and we can add our task right here really easily. So let's just say I wanna add a quick task to my team member. This is what's fun, it's super easy to use. And I'll just say, um, make video for a base, all right? There we go, I've created, I'll double click on it, and I'm gonna be able to edit this. Is there a due date on this? Yeah, let's just say it's due date on Friday. And who am I going to assign this? Well, it's assigned to me and also to Max Steel. Is, this a, is there a priority on this? Well, let's just say that the due date is pretty close. So I'll say it's high. We can add a description to this. So it's about a task management system. All right, just a description there. We can comment in this. So for example, inside of this particular task that I've just created, I can comment and also Max Steel can comment on this. So let's so say, let's do this, all right? And whoever opens up this task, they're gonna be able to view that chat and comment inside of here also. Now, I can see the watchers here. I can do the add subtasks to this. If there's, for example, a second video or something that I need to add to it, some information like a thumbnail, that could be an idea. Add attachments to this. So for example, if there's a thumbnail, I can add it right here. The activities for this, there's a history for the activities. This way I know what I'm doing, he's doing, or what's done. So if something's deleted, changed, commented, or whatever, we're able to view it here. We can also copy this link if you wanna share it, duplicate it or delete it. So it's super easy and we can drag and drop these as we like. So for example, if this is done, well in this case I'm working on it as I'm recording, so it's work on, right? 
We can open the group by section. So by due date, assign a priority so we can have a filter with that. I'll view all the tasks, show completed tasks if I want to show them there. And it's super easy to do that. Now there's a docs section where we can add a document to this. I could do a page for example, and I'll just say, I can write the script for this video. So I'll say script and I'll do blah, blah, blah for the script, right? And we have it there in the same section. The files that we add here. So if I upload a file really quickly, I'm able to view it here. So for example, I'll just add that one there. It's an image and there we go. We have it here. And whoever's assigned to this list, they're able to view those files. Can we schedule? Yes, we can add schedules here. The messages for this particular one, the chat for this particular one. So for example, this is the video, this is one I've just created and I can chat here. So I'll just say here, there we go, I've chatted. And Max Steel should be added to this group. There it is, he's added there. And I've just created this list and it's done really quickly. So Max Steel has been invited to this, this management, this work management. So he's able to work on it, do things with it and add tasks, create tasks, schedules and all of that. And it's super easy to do everything like that. It's a super easy to use management system. And like I said, you won't want to miss out on the free plan that's available as of this video. So it might be gone soon. So don't miss out on it or the great price that they have. Well, I thank you all for watching and this is a wrap.